All right, so let's see if Lori joins us. Good morning. Relax through the shoulders, inhale to one side and exhale to the other side. And just feel that spine start to stretch and lengthen. Opening up the hips, lifting up the opposite heel. And just drop in into your present moment. Out of your head, out of to-do list stories, agendas. Good. And take one arm and open the chest. Inhale as you open. Exhale, bring it back to center. And just feel that pectoral muscle lengthening and opening up. Good. And again, dropping into your present moment, out of your head, out of to-do list, stories, agendas, judgments. Last two, last one. And this workout, I have people live, person live. It's part of the Be Fit With Love program. Thank you for joining me live. Big inhale as you open up that rib on that side. Two more times. And one more time. Good. And then squat and circle those arms back. Reach up and around, lengthen. Lifting your toes, hips are going back. Waking up those legs, opening up the chest and the arms. Inhale down, exhale up. Good, almost there, lengthen. Two more. One more. And then side stretch, lengthen through your side body. Feel that side body stretching, lengthening. So this moving warm up, going through all of your planes of motion of your body, all your joints all of your muscle groups, feeling the ribs pulling off the hips. One more on each side and then cross the chest and look in that direction you're stretching. Relax the shoulders down. Think about a really long neck, pressing the shoulders away from the ears. Inhale, exhale. Good, two more times. One more time. And then elbow goes across the knee, cross, cross, good. Just waking up that hip. Heart rate's gonna start going a little quicker. Lungs contracting and expanding. Body temperature's coming up. And just notice how the body just starts to move in a way that supports you no matter what you choose to do. Knee to the outside. We're picking up that heart rate. The heart rate starts to go a little bit quicker so that you can bring up those legs because the body is always supporting you, always there for you. Good. Two more on each side, just opening up the hips. And now we're gonna squat, kick the butt and pull back. Squat, kick the butt and pull back. And as you kick, you're gonna feel the front of the legs. As you pull back, you feel your pectoral muscles. Opening up. Good. Getting that squat in. And again, that heart starts to go a little bit quicker. Body temperature's coming up. Lungs contracting and expanding. Almost there. Two more. One more. And then we're going to circle the wrists. We're going to go through all your joints. Thank you, hands for all you've done for me and all you do for me, switch directions. Cooking meals, putting on makeup, doing your hair, elbows. Thank you, elbows and arms for all the people you've hugged and groceries you've carried and laundry you've carried, switch directions. Children you've picked up, held close to you. Hands on the hips, circle the hips, all the way around. Good. Last one. And switch directions. Go the other way. Wonderful. Stand up super tall. Arms out. Circle the ankle. Relax the shoulders. Good. Switch directions. 
flex and point. And one more, good, switching feet, going through the ankle and circle. Big toe pushes down, she's the master of balance. Your toe, your big toe is the master of your balance. Flex and point, beautiful. Good, take a step, pressing through the heel. Long neck and inhale forward reach, relax the shoulders down and then stack the spine. Be sure that that heel stays on the floor, gluing it down and then exhale back up. Inhale forward, exhale back up one more time, lengthening. Arms out like a T, let's rotate through the back. Rotate, inhale, exhale, come to center. Inhale, rotate, exhale, come to center. Lengthen. Good, side stretch, lengthen through your side body and switch and switch. One more on each side and switch. Good, lengthening, ribs pulling off the hips and switch sides, pushing through the heel on that other side. Inhale forward, lengthen, relax the shoulders down, stack the spine, lift the chest. Inhale, lengthen, exhale up tall. Good, two more. And one more time, just feeling that lower calf stretch out, arms out like a T, rotate. And just in this present moment, notice whatever you're going through in your life. And what if there's nothing to fix? Side stretch. And I say this for myself, because we're all going through an intense time right now, every single person on the planet. Side stretch. And it is getting closer to the winter solstice, which is the shortest, darkest, um, shortest day of the year. Cross the feet like an X, stand up super tall, reach down with the opposite hand of the front foot. Inhale down, lengthen, and then exhale, sit up super tall, last stack your spine. Inhale, lengthen, reach with that opposite pinky toe and lift the chest. Good, two more, lengthen, and exhale, one more. Good and lift the chest. And now you're gonna switch feet. Cross here, inhale down, lengthen, exhale up. So it is getting close to the winter solstice, the shortest day of the year. And the light will be returning to us shortly. <laughs> so feet under the hips, relax the shoulders, look in one direction, but don't move your shoulders. Our job is, human beings that we are, spiritual beings having a human experience, is just to, uh, ear to the shoulder, is just to acknowledge what we're going through, what we're experiencing, switch sides. And can we go through it without judgment? Can we look at it and go, what if this isn't wrong? What if there's nothing to fix? Tilt the head back, what if I'm just going through an experience? Side to side, turn that head side to side like you're watching a tennis match, right behind your head. Reach up, stretch those arms, lengthen through the body and circle the body all the way around. Lengthen, 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 good. And switch directions. Lengthen, 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 lengthen. Beautiful, now we're just gonna fold forward. Just let your body fold and just hold. Lengthening in through that back and notice how far you can go because we're gonna check in again with this at the end of the workout. Take a big deep breath into the ribs and then slowly come up. Good, now grab your bicep free weights, your heavier pair. So if you have heavy and light, you're gonna grab the heavier side, heavier pair. And I'm gonna stand over here because we're gonna do a little stand, a little walking uh, side to side squats. So squats, you want to lift your toes up. So you want to drop the hips back and oh, see, I'm almost falling back. We don't want to go straight down. You don't want the knees in front of your toes. You want your hips back behind your heels. So we're going to start with just eight singles. Inhale down, exhale eight. <sighs> Pushing through your heels, thinking of imagining that earth right underneath you because it is, but Pressing against the soil of the earth. Inhale, exhale, pushing through the heels. Good, we're gonna do four more. And then we're gonna start, start our side squats. Good, inhale, 
Exhale. Good. Two more. Nice and easy. One more. Nice and easy. And now this one we're going to do one. So squat down. As you stand, feet come together. And then step out. Squat. Stand. Feet come together. Step out. Squat. Stand. Feet come together. Beautiful. Inhale. Exhale. This movement nice and slow. Inhale and exhale. And this space, which is your space in your body, noticing how the legs start to fire up. Notice how you're starting to feel this in your arms. Notice how you're starting to feel this in your glutes and your hamstrings and your quads. Inhale down. Exhale up. Going for time. We have 30 more seconds. Keep going. Notice how the body is adjusting as it needs to adjust. Heart rate comes up a little bit more. Lungs are picking up their pace. Body temperature is coming up. Exactly what we want. Almost there. Good. Last one, hold it here. Now, pick up one foot, put it on your thigh for tree pose. Elbows come in close, take the hands behind the legs. Eight, good. Seven, use the breath. Exhale, lift, and you can bring your foot all the way down to the floor too. Just have it off the floor. You can bring it up higher if you'd like. For those yogis, I'm not a yogi. I'm losing it, <laughs> I lost it, okay. Two more. Last one. All right, going back. Widen those feet. Here we go. We're doing it again. Inhale, bring it up. So we're going all the way to fatigue today with those biceps. I know you're feeling those arms. We're going all the way to fatigue, which means if it gets too hard to stay with the pace, you can always do one arm at a time. Or you can just put your hands down and just do your legs. So we want to go to fatigue where those arms are going, I'm so done. Inhale, exhale. And if you don't get there, after this, your one, <laughs> your, your weights might be too light, or you just totally, you were able to stay with it with those free weights. And that's perfect. If you don't feel your arms by now, the weight is for sure too light. 30 seconds to go. Use the breath. Exhale. Wonderful. Almost there. And 15 more seconds. Stay with it. Loving those arms, elbows in close. Don't let the elbows come up off the body. Strong, powerful body. Good. Last one. Hold it here. Put that foot on the thigh. And again, it's how high is up to you. Elbows in close. Bring it up. Eight. Exhale. Use the breath. Seven. Six. Exhale. Five. Exhale. Four. There's a mosquito trying to get me. Three. There we go. Two. And one. Yes. Release those free weights. We have a little bit of an interval. We're gonna do a jump squat. Now, if you have any knee issues, you can just squat reach. Um, this is actually a burpee. I wanna come all the way down. <clears throat> so we just do 10 of these. So we're gonna squat, jump, down, out. Now, if you can't come all the way down, what you can do is you can come down, step out, step in, and that's fine. 10 of them, here we go. 10, nine, and again, stepping out is fine. Eight, seven, <clears throat> and if you don't want to come all the way down, that's fine too. Six, five, four, three, two, almost there. One, walk it out, grab some water. 
Breathe through that. Keep breathing through that. Great job. Wonderful. We'll get the heart rate down from here. Rotate through your spine. So however you did that was perfect for your body. Each one of us has our own unique body and our own unique experience in this present moment. And just let that be whatever it is. It's your soul's journey right now. Grab your light, light free weights. We're gonna point the toes out, stack the spine, it's long neck. Come down and hold the position. Can you see your toes? When you look over your knees, can you see your toes? We want to see the toes over the knees, right? Elbows are soft. Hands in front, palms face each other. Inhale, exhale. Soft elbows. Don't lock them out. Nice, soft elbows. Good. Stack the spine, book on your head. Use the breath. Exhale, come up. Beautiful. Four more, that's halfway. Powerful, strong body. Vibrant and healthy. Powerful, strong body. Great posture and flexibility. Last one is right here. This is the last one. Now in front of you, go in front. Soft elbows. Nice, soft elbows. Exhale, lift. Powerful, strong body. Vibrant and healthy. Good, powerful, strong body. Energetic, great posture. Four more. Powerful and strong. Good posture and flexibility. Powerful and vibrant. Healthy immune system. Now you're gonna bring the weights here to 90 degrees. Inhale, power up, strong. Inhale, exhale, grateful for life. Even though this experience is heavy right now, we are having a human experience. That's why we came. We're always taken care of. We're always guided. Inhale, exhale. Trusting in a higher power that created us. Trusting in the frequency of love. Trusting in the frequency that grows these trees behind me. Last one. Slowly bring the weights down to the thighs. Drop down, halfway up, relax the shoulders. Exhale as you lift, stay strong with it. Let it burn, those legs firing up. It's exactly what we want. Good, eight more, hold on. Let it burn, seven, powerful legs, strong legs, firm legs. Exhale, lift, powerful, strong, firm. Vibrant, again, two more. Powerful last one is strong. Come up, shake it out. Awesome, one more set of our jump squats or burpees. So remember, uh, you don't have to go to the floor. You can just reach up. You, can, you don't even have to jump. You can just go onto your toes. That's fine. Otherwise, you can come up, you can come down, you can walk it out and then walk it in. That's fine too. Here we go, 10. Whatever way works for you. Nine. Eight. Exhale as you reach. Seven. Six. Five, almost there, hold on. Four. Three. Two. One, walk it out, grab some water. Great job, that was our last one. Get the heart rate down. Woo, nice work on that. Rotate through the back. Breathe, really good job. Notice how the heart rate's coming down. Yeah, the body just naturally supports you. All right, we're gonna come to the mat. 
we're going to start with side planks with the free weights. So have your free weights close by. I'm going to bring the camera down a little bit. Maybe pull this a little bit over here as well. There we go. All right. So light free weights close by. Okay. We're going to be on to our elbow now. You want your elbow right below your shoulder. You don't want it in front of the shoulder up here. That's going to bother the shoulder. You want that elbow right below the shoulder. Lift the chest. Grab the free weight. We're going to go up to the sky. So you can be on your knee. See, I'm on my knee. That's fine. Hip is lifted or I'm on my toes. Exhale, open. Eight, seven, six, five, almost there. Four, three, two, one. Release. Second part. You can bend your knee. It's a lot easier. You're going to reach that top hand up above your head. You're going to bring your elbow behind your knee. Bending the knee is much easier. All right. The second level is to be on the foot. Eight. Lost it. Seven. There we go. Six. Exhale. Five. Push. Four. Three. Two. One, drop, lift the chest, shoulder stretch, bring it across the body, relax the shoulder down away from the ear. Think about a really long neck, lifting that chest. Great job with that. Good. Now you're going to take it up over the head, grab the wrist, feel the ribs pull off the hips. Big inhale, half a circle, half a circle, half a circle. Grab the wrist and pull. Good. One more time. Good, nice job. Now sit up super tall, rotate toward the legs, palms up. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Switch sides, other side. Take the weight in front of you, light free weight or no weight. Remember to line up that elbow with the shoulder. Grab the free weight and exhale, lift. Open it up. Use the breath as you exhale, lift. Now you can come up on the toes. You don't have to be on that knee. You want to make it more challenging. Good. That's halfway. Four more. Four. Almost there. Three. Two. Wonderful. Nice. Now you can be on the knee. Reach the hand above your head. Elbow goes behind the knee. Stay on that knee, that's fine. Or coming up. Eight, seven. This mosquito's still trying to get me. Six, five. Oop, I lost it. Four, three, two. Wonderful. Yes. Drop down, shoulder stretch, bring it across the body. Nice job. So acknowledge yourself for doing this workout because that part wasn't easy. If you're still watching, <laughs> if you're live, I know. Thank you for being here, Pam. Reach out, have a circle. And if you're watching the recording, it's awesome that you're still here. A lot of people go, oh, I'm over that. <laughs> Rotate, palms up, long neck, shoulders down. 10, 9, 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, two and one. All right, we're gonna come onto our back. We have a single straight legged stretch. Turning the mic so it doesn't fall off my head. There we go. So here again, you can uh, keep your head on the floor for level one. You don't have to lift the head up, all right? You can lift the head uh, supported with one hand. I like to support my neck with one hand and then grab the calf with the other side to side. And if you have a strong neck, only if you have a strong neck, then grab both, grab the calf with both hands, lift the head unsupported. Good. Four more in the ring a little quicker. I like to support my head. Three, two, and now just a little bit faster. Here we go. Eight, switch, seven, six, 
five, four, three, two, one. Head down on the floor, legs wide, knees drop side to side. Open through the hips, open through the hips. Great work on that. We have crisscrosses, one hand on top of the other one, thumbs on the neck. We're gonna go elbows out, we're gonna go inhale and exhale, and inhale and exhale. 25, and then we're done with this. 24, exhale, 23. Now, if it's too hard, you can put the, or for a less challenging one, put the feet on the floor and just lift up the opposite shoulder. All right, that's level one. Exhale, extend. Let's call that 10, switch, nine, switch, eight, and seven. Go, six, almost there, five. Strong, go four. Powerful, go three. Loving, go two. Kind, and one is patient. Legs wide. Those are all things I'm working on. <laughs> Oh my goodness gracious, it is the time we're in. All right, last one is rolling like a ball. So it's coming up. Put my mic so hopefully it doesn't fall off my head. Feet off the floor, relax the shoulders. We're gonna inhale, scoop, and then exhale, balance the feet off the floor. Good, inhale, exhale, relax the shoulders. Last one. Level two, put the hands in front or cross like a sh cross the wrists. Use the breath to come up. Inhale, exhale, inhale. And level three, last one is open-legged rocker. Inhale, grabbing the calves, lifting up. And that's fine if you need to bend those knees. Relax the shoulders. Good, four more and we're done. Four, relax the shoulders as you finish the position. Hey, that looks awesome. Three, use that breath. Two, one more. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Coming on to the hands and knees. All right, put the free weights on each side. Coming to the belly. Grab the free weights, palms up. Nice long neck. So we're gonna lift up the free weights. Now, if the weights get too heavy, just put them to the side, all right? You're gonna tuck the chin nice and long and just lift the arms, keep the feet down on the floor. So don't use the legs, exhale, lift. Now, if you wanna challenge your lower back more, you can lift up the feet in neutral or your heels touch. But any back issues, just keep your feet down on the floor. Two more and then we slow the pace, one more. Now lifting for four, one, two, three, four, down, two, three, four, exhale, two, three, four, down, two, three, two, two, three, four, down, two, three, three, two, three, four, that is halfway, down, two, three, five, lift, two, three, four, down, two, three, six, two more, down, two, three, seven, one more, eight singles, here we go, eight, seven, exhale, six, five, Four, three, two, wonderful. Chin on your hands, push your heels side to side, relax your lower back. Superman is next. Reach the hands forward, relax the shoulders. Opposite hand, opposite leg if you're at level one. Just starting off, opposite hand, opposite leg, or both hands, both legs. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, pull the belly in, inhale, release. Exhale, good, and then when you're ready, tuck your chin down and look straight down at the floor. Relax the shoulders, think of a long neck. Exhale, lift, four more, four, three, two, and one. Chin on your hands, push your heels side to side, relax that lower back. Think of a happy spine, happy back. We're gonna reach down the hands. Hands reach down. This is one of my favorites because it's oblique and lower back. Reach for your knees, but keep those hips down. Don't let the opposite hip come up. Look toward the toes, come to center. Inhale as you extend, 
Exhale, pull the belly in. Inhale as you extend, look toward those toes because we're also getting the amazing neck involved here. So you got your obliques, your lower back, your neck. Reaching down, last one on each side. Exhale. And inhale and exhale. Sit back on the heels. Open the knees wide. Stretch through the uh, through child's pose. Excuse me, lengthen through your arms. Woo. <clears throat> and roll the hips side to side. Roll the hips, excuse me. <clears throat> All right. Lengthen through the lower back. Round like a cat. Round it up. And last push up, uh, regular push ups, elbows flare out. Here we go. Remember the hands are in front of the chest, are in the line to put the chest. Inhale, exhale. <clears throat> you do not want your hands in front of your shoulders because you'll not have happy shoulders. Power up, exhale up. Good, this is halfway. Four more, almost there. Power, good. Strong, vibrant, and last one. Healthy, beautiful job. Opening up in child's pose, stretching those arms, lengthening the chest. Big deep breath into the low back. One more time, big deep breath. Roll the hips side to side. Beautiful, awesome. And now coming onto the back. We're gonna lay on back. Take one leg forward, one leg up and one leg down and circle the ankle, pull that leg in with the um, calf. Don't grab behind your knee, above or below your knee. And you're circling your ankle. Great, and then flex and point, nice. Now just pull that leg in, hold it in. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, <clears throat> take it across the body, rest the arm on the, on the thigh, look away from the leg, and a big inhale down your back. Open the back with your breath. Open the back with your breath. Oh, wonderful. One more time. Big deep breath. Nice job. Switching legs, switching legs. Bring it up, circle, 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 circle. We love that leg. Thank you, thank you, foot. Switch directions and flex some point. Pull, 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 pull. 10, 9, 8, 5, 4, 3, 2, and take it across. Rest the arm on the thigh, look away from the leg. A big inhale down the back. Just think, thank you back for all of the support that you give to me turning, bending, rotating. So much appreciation for you, thank you. Big inhale. And on the exhale, slowly come up. Nicely done. We're gonna bring soles of the feet together. Think of stacking that spine. Got it. And right here, right now, think of one thing you're grateful for sun shining on the earth as it has since the beginning of time and since the beginning of the earth anyway. The soil right now is supporting the seeds of the plants we'll be eating, the vegetation we'll be eating, vegetables. Take the legs forward, arms out like a T, rotate, stretch for the opposite pinky toe, lengthen, and then sit up super tall and lengthen and sit up super tall. Good, one more each side. Stretch, just honoring this amazing body. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Wonderful. Now slowly gonna come up onto the hands and knees so let's stretch out the hips. Take one leg forward. Make sure the toes are in front of your knee. That's important. Toes are in front of your knee. And then those of you who can, who are more flexible, you can reach back with the same hand. Grab the foot, as long as that doesn't bother your knee bothers your knee, just keep leaning forward. Acknowledge this amazing body for what it can do for you, how much it supports you every single day, walking, sitting, driving, 
doing a computer, groceries, doing your hair, release that. Hands on the lower back. See if my head doesn't get cut off. There we go. And push the hips forward. Now the same hand as the leg that's back, the same hand as the leg that's back goes over the head. You're gonna feel this in the oblique, which is where we want it. There's a muscle there, circle, circle the hip slowly, three times in each direction, circle three times. There's a muscle in there that is um, your psoas, which connects your hip to your back. Switch directions, and that's exactly what we wanna stretch. Now push your hips forward, reach over, 10, nine, six, five, four, three, two, and one, beautiful. Switch legs, take the leg forward, make sure the toes are in front, lengthening, great job. Ooh, take some deep breaths. And then those of you who can, reach back, grab the foot as long as it doesn't bother that amazing knee because we love our knees. So much appreciation for our knees, ankles, toes, calves, thighs, quads, hamstrings, hips, IT band outside of the hip. Loving it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And release. Hands go on the lower back. Push those hips forward. Take the same hand as the leg that's back over. Feel that in that oblique right there in that rib and in the, in the side of the oblique. And circle one, two, three, switch direction, one, two, push those hips forward, reach over your head, really get that, that oblique in there, getting that psoas muscle, we love that psoas, thank you for connecting our back to our hip, so much appreciation for that, child's pose, open the knees, lengthen through the arms, stretch and sit back, now just surrender anything out of your control, just say higher self, infinite intelligence, source of all things, I just give it to you, I don't know why things are the way they are sometimes, but I trust, I trust there's a plan here. Roll the hips side to side. Beautiful. All right, we have two more stretches. You're gonna go downward dog, tuck the toes underneath, press the chest toward the legs, relax the shoulders down, alternate your knees. Seven, good, six, Five, four, three, almost there. Two, almost there. And one. Just walk those hands in, stand it up. I'm gonna see if my head, it does get cut off. So I'm going to lift the camera a tad so you can see the top of my head. <laughs> All right. So from here, tilt the head to one side, grab your wrist. Pull your wrist in the same direction your head's tilted in and then give it a side yes. Hello, side yes. Thank you, neck, thank you, neck. And a no. How many years has his head, has his neck supported your head? So many. Tell, turn it to the other side. Again, pull the wrist in the same direction your head's tilted in and give it a side yes. Thank you, neck, for supporting me. Thank you, head, and no. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Good. And then stand up super tall, tilt the head back and watch a tennis match side to side. Nice and easy. Side to side, good. Reach the hands up, stretch those arms and circle your back all the way around. Circle, 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 circle. Good, and switch directions other way. Lengthen, lengthen, lengthen. Now we get to, we get to find out how far we can go down compared to when we started. Lengthen down, I'm going further, I'm sure you are. Hold that for 10, and nine, and eight, and seven, and six, and five, four, three. Now, as you come up, you're just gonna rub those legs. Rub those legs, it's my favorite parts. And you're gonna rub the belly. You're gonna rub your arms. You're gonna rub your upper back, shoulder blades, lower back. Oh yeah, that feels good for that lower back and the glutes and the hamstrings. Good, and now you're gonna wipe everything down. So start at the head and just wipe, just wipe in front of you like you're wiping something off your body. Just send that energy, any stress energy to the earth. She can take it. She is a transformer, a magician transformer. Like Pele, who I'm on the big island, 
We have Madame Pele, our volcano, which is shielding volcano that is still erupting right now in this very moment. So from here, you're going to breathe into the body. Healing, light, transformation, destruction and creation, which is what Pele is about. Madam Pele, the volcano, bringing up, integrating the normalness of a human being, which you are. So breathing into your body, light, energy, vitality, and surrender things that just don't feel good. Like let it be okay that sometimes you get angry. I do. I get angry sometimes and I get frustrated. And that's a part, a normal part of being human. And there are positive ways to deal with it. And also acknowledging that that's also being a human being. And that's okay. Nothing right, nothing wrong, nothing good, nothing bad, and nothing to fix. Hands on the heart. Repeat after me. And Pam, if you want to unmute. <laughs> Repeat after me. I am a healthy, fit person. I am a healthy, fit person. My body loves it when I work out. My body loves it when I work out. I make healthy, fit choices every day because I'm worth it. I make healthy fit choices every day because I'm worth it. And this is going to be a great day. This is going to be a great day. Great. Awesome. Well, much mahalo for joining and aloha. I will see you next time.